It's very easy to make fun of Animorphs. Sorry, what? No, no, that was the end of the sentence. Uh, people do like to take pot shots at this line though, just because most of them look absolutely fucking terrible. But they are also official Transformers. Here, look. Look, there's no denying it. Animorphs are humans that can turn into animals. We all know that, yeah? You've all read each one of the 54 main series novels, yeah? You've all watched every episode of Animorphs, the TV show, yeah? You're really the infamous Skyjacker, D.B. Cooper, yeah? Aha! Just what I wanted to hear. Take them away, boys. I had to get Marco the Gorilla here, mint on package. Look at this incredible artwork. Marco is pretty terrifying in all stages of metamorphosis, even his human form. Just look at those dead eyes. Back of the card gives us a small bit of background info on the Animorphs and their war against the alien Yerks, as well as a little bio from Marco himself. He says he'll show the Yerks he means business. Monkey business. Yes, exactly the kind of humour we like here at TRDQ. We also have instructions which are already making me wince a little bit, and some other Animorphs for you to lust after. I'm very much digging Rachel the Lion and her 80s hair metal look. Looking at Marco, before I open this thing up, it's hard to say exactly how I feel. I mean, this looks absolutely awful, of course, but it is also a gorilla, and, and how bad can that be? Cracking this sucker open, we see the accessories. Marco's battle chain, I'm assuming a, a yerk bug alien thing, and of course these big gorilla mitts in case he gets cold. So the mode Marco comes packaged in is a kind of weird hybrid mutant mode as there are three heads on this thing. You can fold out the human head and make no mistake this is supposed to be his human form. We see this very disturbing fella with his gorilla shoulders, back and legs, but also a pair of red jorts and a front of a torn t-shirt and, and human hands. I have to say it, I hate it, but also I can't help but laugh at it. Getting Marco into his gorilla mode is really just a case of rotating the torso and flipping out the fully morphed gorilla head. There's some crud around the cod piece, you have to remove that and pull around to the other side, slip on his mittens, and there we have a pretty decent looking gorilla. I mean, it, it's fine. It, it can't really bend over or anything, the legs don't go that way, so you have this kind of standing fully upright look, but you can put the chain in his hand and get some fairly menacing poses out of him. Monkey business is right, this toy is... Well, it's it's largely terrible. You know, it is going to go on the monkey shelf, of course, but that's only because I have no pride whatsoever. 